Okay, this is a basic Photoshop uh, tutorial for Games for Windows DVD template. Uh, the request was done, I believe, by Dark Minds. Uh, basically, you open up your template, click on the file menu, click on open, find the image that you want to go ahead and use um, for the template. Once you have it, and I mean, this is a crude way of doing it. I'm probably going to get a bunch of flack from all the professional Photoshoppers out here, but this is the easiest way to do it for everybody else. Uh, basically, open it up, got both the images side by side, drag it across. When you drag it across, of course, it's not filling up that area. Not a big deal. A lot of people don't like to use you know, free transform. I'm using it right now because it's quick, it's easy, and you can get this tutorial done pretty quick. But basically you stretch it out, and by the way you can access free transform in the edit menu in Photoshop. It's up there in the edit menu, I believe it's, yeah, it's like down right there. Sorry for the image, but... And once you have it set the way you want it, go ahead and click the checkbox up here, which is, it was right here, and pretty much have it done. Go to the file menu, click a save as, name it whatever you want to name it, save it in a PNG format. In this case, it's... Uh, Age of Wonders. I usually just save it to my desktop and then put it wherever I want to. Click OK. Now, I keep this one's a new template, but I usually keep all of these additions inside the template. So if I need to go back real quick and make any changes, I just can. Basically, to do another one, you just remove, you know, this image here, basically, and go to the next one. And that's basically it. And you can close out of Photoshop. And let's see. There's the Age of Wonders PNG. And as you can see, it looks fine looks crisp and that's my tutorial there you go dark vines